Once you shot me, I will leave you to the mercy, mercy of the mobs. I'm out. <laughs> the inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. Hey, what you got in the shop for me? Hey, a silver lining just in time for tea. Hey, a chaos touched me. Step the bleed, to the mind intensity. Hey, I'm jumping ship and I'm giving up. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another amazing glitch brought to you by Games Glitches. And in today's episode, of course, we're gonna talk about another glitch. Now, this glitch is going to be a uh, Casper 1.3. Basically, the place that you need to go is right outside of DZ7. I actually read a forum post online, you know, people complaining that, well, there are people who are invisible. And, well, this glitch does fully exist. For example, if I aggro that mob right there, you know, and I pull him up over here, I'm just gonna hide for a moment so he runs up. And if I proceed to jump over here and just simply move back, the mob instantly forget him, forgets about me. If I move forward, it sees me once again. Same goes for PvP. You could of course shoot your mobs from here and once you're tired you can basically step back and the mobs no longer see you. In a way you could use this as a well basically a uh, farming technique. You know just literally leave your character here AFK, shoot periodically and so on. And then as you step back they completely lose track of you. But there is more to this glitch than just simply this. If you are in this area, a regular player cannot see you. My friend uh, Z0 here, you know, Twitch Z0 from a Twitch channel, you know, decided to help me out. He's going to be my, vic I mean, my helper for this episode. In any case, ladies and gentlemen, uh, basically the way this glitch works, let's say, for example, a rogue is chasing you. Right here, I went rogue on my friend. Right now, you would just simply run away, jump over, and wapa! You just simply, well, just fucking like Houdini, disappear into the fence. From your, his point of view, nothing really changes. From your point of view, you can't even see the target. Now, if he steps forward, Zero, could you step forward please to next to the fence and uh, shoot at me? He will basically, well, appear. And if he starts to shoot at me, he actually g goes rogue. And once again, and he disappears like magic <laughs> cause why? cause division though division did on the other hand try to fix the glitch on this side so you guys could see the lazy and fucked up job they decided to do they kinda decided to put well four garbage bags tape them with scotch tape and put them in front of the area where you should be able to jump into it but somebody but I guess they ran out of garbage bags or somebody accidentally didn't put the garbage bags a little bit too much to the left. You know, because when you drink a little bit too much, everything tends to slide to the left. So when you get shit faced at work, you know, and well, you'll basically end up with this scenario right here. In any case, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this nice little Casper 3.0 glitch video. And right here I got Momo who, you know, we invited to be in a video earlier, decided to shoot us and then we kind of killed him and took his shit. This time around, you know, maybe he'll behave himself and we won't have to resolve to absolute brutality. I'm also going to be part doing Division uh, Destiny 2, including a massive beta giveaway. I managed to get my hands on a buttload of keys. Well, AK ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this nice little video. I want to thank Twitch04 for helping me out, and I am sure to going to be looking out for more new glitches to come. As usual, if you enjoyed this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. And please also don't forget about the weekly giveaway in the description below. You're still here. It's over. Go home. What are you expecting? Sam Jackson show up with an eye patch and a saucy little leather number? Go.